Today is 18th of January. So for the past two weeks, it has been raining like every single day from morning to night, like 24 hours type of rain. And it's very difficult to dry the laundry. Thankfully, I bought my dryer and washer just before the monsoon season started. Yeah, so I was quite lucky. Anyway, uh, there are two types of monsoon in Singapore, the rainy monsoon and the dry monsoon. It's such a windy day today. The young court there on the right side is no more. It's going to be demolished. How did they even get that digger up there? These boats are usually for tourists, but with the border restrictions, um, we are not getting many tourists. One thing I've not noticed until today is the design at the front of the boat. You see the green patch there? That design can actually be found at the train station on the ground. See those buildings over there? I'm very intrigued by the old style architecture, more specifically the designs at the edges at the top. You see those parts that were painted with yellow and black? That is quite interesting. Anyway, today I'm here to sketch this building, Park Royal Collection Pickering, which is a hotel. Uh, I'm here for no particular reason. This is a very beautiful hotel. The design here is one of hotel in a garden. So they actually have terrace gardens built beside the hotel room. So many of the hotel rooms um, are actually just beside the garden. The building on the right side is probably an office block and below that building, you can see the greenery overflowing past the platform. So it looks like they are using the same design motif for the entrance to the train station. And this is Hong Ling Park, one of Singapore's earliest public park. And it's located just in front of the hotel. So this is the only area in Singapore where you can hold public protests. I'm actually not sure how effective the protests are. Anyway, whenever there are protests, usually organized protests, and you have to submit your protest to the government prior to having your protest here. Nowadays, um, I think you can get your word out to more people using social media rather than coming down here. Oh, okay, there is a police post here at the top right side. That's very convenient. Due to the pandemic, there are actually regulations here that prevent groups from um, gathering in sizes more than eight. This is actually the new regulation. It used to be five. Oh, there is a safe entry QR code here as well. So this is for the public to scan so that they can be contacted in case there are any infectious people uh, who visit the park at the same time as the person who is scanning the QR code. This is exactly what I read on Wikipedia. And there's this nice little cafe here inside the park. And behind the cafe is actually a gym. This is the stage. I wonder why they have so many huge tires here. Even the bottom of the hotel looks really cool. All right, I shall sketch here. The stage is going to be in front of the hotel no matter where I go. So I'll just make do here. This is a pretty nice view. I just hope that there are no ants on the grass that I'm about to sit on.
just a really quick pen and ink sketch. So now I'm just going to add some details like the trees, maybe some texture on the side of the hotel using really thin lines. So this is my usual setup. This is a custom made sketchbook with Archer's cold press watercolor paper. And this is the micro portable painter that I have clipped to the sketchbook. And this is the Da Vinci Cassano watercolor brush with a sword tip. This sketch probably took me one and a half hours to sketch and paint and thankfully the weather today is fantastic. The blue used here is cobalt blue dip, the yellow is azo yellow and for the greens I use azo yellow and phthalo blue. I'm not sure what rate I use, probably a warm rate. I also use some yellow ochre. All right, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video, especially for those who are still under some sort of lockdown. Meanwhile, stay safe. Bye.